Hey everyone, Shadow Knight Paladin here, and welcome back to my channel. Today's another outfit design commission, and if you've seen my older videos or the ones from the past, this character might be familiar. So again, we are working on Jamil the Achillean, who is this snooty, princely, genius, bratty character. And this time, we are working on his um, military on the field outfit. So we already have the base from the one that we worked on in the previous video and we're just gonna work on the clothes on top of the base. As this is the military outfit, it's going to be a bit more formal and less complicated or frilly than the original. And like the first video, we are just gonna work on the first layer in this video mainly because I don't have the footage for the second layer. The idea for this was something a little bit stiffer than the original. In terms of the material used in this particular set, it was meant to be a bit more formal as I mentioned, so that means it's a bit more stiffer. It doesn't give this really soft texture to it, but it's also meant to be a bit warm as, as their world does have winters, so it's meant to be somewhat comfy but not too casual. I gave him some pockets, which is really cute. I mean, you could store some stuff in those pants. So the pockets are outlined with this going to be, you'll see later, golden trimming. So the pockets are a bit loose, just so that he can keep whatever stuff he needs. I don't know. What, what's, what does a military strategist need? And you can see here, I did not follow my sketch for the shoes. This mainly because I felt it was too fun. It was too preppy, I guess. So I made it a little bit more flatter, more formal, with just very minimal design. So this is going to be a relatively short video. I mean, against the other ones that I have. It's a bit shorter since we are starting with lines right away and now we're jumping into color so that's gonna be pretty fast. This was originally streamed on um, September 11, 20, 2015. So my art style is similar but not what I use now. But it's okay. It's, it's not that bad I think. Or at least that's, that's what I say now since it's not been a few years yet. So I'll get back to it when, I don't know, 2018, 19, and we'll see what my opinion is. So you can see I referenced the older picture and a very old picture. That was the first draft of this design, or rather, that was, that was the first design I made for this character, but that was done in, I, I guess, 2012-ish, and it's been so long. The art style's changed, my fashion sense has changed, and I, I guess I'm more diverse in terms of what I draw now, in terms of the clothing of my characters at the very least, and when I looked back at it, I was like, uh does not look good or rather it doesn't fit the character anymore so I redesigned it
color scheme, if you watch the first video, for this particular character, it's very dark. Uh, he does not like bright colors. If ever, it's gonna be like small accents, like gold. <laughs> but he likes neutral, uh, plain, and not very, not very outstanding clothes. Then again, this is, I don't know, maybe part of his tactics. After all, he's supposed to be this genius that shouldn't really have that spotlight on him. Since if he does make military plans and stuff, that's gonna be a big problem if people find out or the enemy finds out that he is the one. And wearing bright or very outstanding clothing would draw attention to you. And it would also make you much more easier to identify. I mean, that's why some people wear like really colorful or bright or really fancy outfits because I guess it's that, it's their expression. But this character isn't like that. So, the most color I could do was blue, gold, white, silver, grays. And it, it fit. I mean, I'm not gonna force colorful stuff on this character. But they're not available. <laughs> So as you can see on the boots, I add the little like stitching just to give it a little bit more texture design to it rather than just rather than just a flat boot. So that's like the zipper area where you know it would be easier to take it off. Uh, we're nearing the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed, and actually, I'll link or I'll put it in a annotation at the end of, at the ending screen if you want to watch the first video on this or the first designing for this character it'll be there i'll put the link in the description as well and see you around